Ladies and gentlemen, I do have some disturbing news. Despite the uh, Valentine's Day massacre, as you already know, as you found out yesterday, though, despite the Valentine's Day massacre that occurred in Parkland, Florida, that is in a Parkland high school, that is, well, 17 people were severely dead. Seven of them had to be gone to medical facilities. Seven, seven, seven of them were hospitalized. Some of them were. The other half of them were pretty much in disbelief. And I understand that a lot of you fans out there watching at home, watching on the country in disbelief as well. Some of these guys are affected. Even some of my fans and viewers, subscribers, and some of the, I mean, this affects the sports realm as well, though. But a 19-year-old has been in custody and arrested and charged with assassinating 17 students in a Parkland High School that was in Florida, that is. So again, my thoughts and and we understand that the fans, the students, the teachers, and cops and officers were affected by this tragedy. We understand that some of the folks the area that I'm in, the other high schools and all over the country, even the Lyon County schools, even the colleges as well, they're in, they're in disbelief as well. But we understand that a lot of viewers, subscribers out there are wondering exactly as to how this came about. And, you know, Anthony... Anthony Rizzo, Cubs player that is, he got got out of high school. His coach is out. He graduated from from that high school for sure. His fans, yeah, they loved him, supported him, loved him a lot. But it's gonna be, you know, having his voice heard. It's gonna have a brief discussion by next week though. So hopefully, you all get the chance to hear from him. And you know, Valentine's, you know. Love, you know, Valentine's yesterday was love is in the air. I mean, not just, come on, there's no need for the violence and all this stuff. Come on. But it's obvious, you know, my thoughts and prayers are with, are with the folks and the fans and teachers and students of this Valentine's Day tra Valentine's Day massacre and this tra and this hellacious tragedy that occurred in Parkland, Florida. I was pleased to grow, go out to you. And not only does this affect the sports industry and the sports world, but it affects but it affects a lot of people out there, folks in the Lowen County area, the schools, the other students, the high schools and colleges. It affects the sports industry as well. That we understand that I know you guys, the Parkland, Florida residents out there, individuals. I know you guys are are just in in disbelief right now, in absolute pain, and I understand how you feel, guys, are feeling right now. Send our thoughts to you. To the fans, to the viewers, subscribers out there. But if you want to share your, share your, send your comments down below. Make sure you like, subscribe. Make sure that you, now will be the time to do so. Make sure, ladies and gentlemen, that you like, subscribe to my YouTube channel. And also like, subscribe to my Khalil, the Highlight Real Sports Sport. On this disturbing announcement of the, about this Valentine's Day massacre that happened yesterday at Parkland, Florida. We understand that many of the fans out there are, you know, an absolute dis disdain and we understand that this tragedy has recently hit hard to everyone around the country and around the globe and all the fans and viewers subscribers out there and it affects the sports industry as well though so thoughts prayers go out to you though so please ladies and gentlemen make sure you like subscribe to my youtube channel like subscribe to my club the highlight real sports board send your comments down below on facebook twitter instagram snapchat if necessary though but we understand this is really tough tough though so thoughts prayers go out to you probably in florida though so take care you guys you guys, you guys have a good day. Bye-bye.